the first one come up, the other two just lay there. Yeah, come on up. Okay, so tell us your name. My name is Klopna. And yeah, everyone wants to applaud you. I understand that you have two children. That's correct. And the youngest one is six. He's six. He's six. right there. Where are you? Uh, Yay! Uh, there he is. And he has a special distinction. He is the only member of your family who is not a mom. <laughs> and he's hanging on to that distinction. Yes. yes. But first, your husband wrote a book because he's the matriarch of the family. And then when young Sanjana, you should come up here. Sanjana, you get up here. Oh, she's taking a picture of me. No, it's more important that you be up here. The husband, he can wait. Sanjana, get up here. Look at this, look at this. She's so gorgeous. And she, how old are you now? 13. 13, 13 years old. She published her book when she was 12. So your dad was first and then you. And now you, because you actually run the family. So you were just kind of pushing power to all the others. I was letting power. them, yes. Yes, you were letting them <laughs> pretend they were first and second. <laughs> and then you showed your own power. Yes. So tell me, what problem did you have? No, you cut right in here. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> what problem did you have in your life relative to the issue of your book before you wrote your book? I did not have my own identity. So you were a quote, typical wife, you were taking care of your kids, taking care of your husband, being kind to everybody else in the world. That's correct. Except yourself. I was happy. Yes, of course. I was... Uh, you were doing a good yes, wife and mother Yes, absolutely. And I loved doing that. Yeah, of course. But I felt I was meant to do more. I felt I was meant to give something to this world. Yes. I was put on this earth for some purpose. But you couldn't do it if you were just serving others and being invisible yourself. That's correct. What was the easiest part of writing a book using my program? The program itself, the modules, that just... You play the video? Yes, just play the video and do exactly as you say what's in the video. And then you and play the next video and do yeah. what I say. Just go what with what you say, that's it. And then when you play the last video, you'll be on stage at your book launch. Absolutely. <laughs> Is that how it works for you? <laughs> Woo Woo Tell me a miracle that's happened in your life because of your book. One. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> wow, there are so many miracles. Tell us a good one. Okay, can I say three? <laughs> Please? All right. <laughs> Okay, first of all, the biggest miracle for me is that I have rediscovered who I am. That's unbelievably Woo! true. Yeah. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! You know when you see somebody who's good looking and they say they just lost 200 pounds, but you can't experience it because you didn't know what they looked like 200 pounds ago. Well, she was a nice, sweet, gentle, <laughs> invisible soul. She was sweet. She was always nice. I always spent lots of time with her husband, and she was always nice. But now, she has such power. She gave her own speech for the first time after writing her book. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how wonderful to see this group. That's right, so I speak at my own events. I hold workshops. She does, I... do you get this? She holds her own workshops. <laughs> <laughs> <She's>... <laughs> invited to speak as a guest speaker last weekend at the Toronto Women's Club. Oh, wow. Woo! Now, why did you do? Because of my book. <laughs> she, she existed before, but they never invited her. How many times have you ever been invited to give a speech in your life before the book? No. no. Not. But you can see by your face, it wasn't just a no, it was like, not on this planet. Really? Yeah. And now I have, I'm coaching other people. Goodness <laughs> gracious. I have 15 clients and growing no more. Way. <laughs> and the biggest news that I want to share with you yes. on your stage yes. is this. I am invited to be a guest speaker in November, sharing stage with Brian Tracy. Whoa! Ha, ha, ha.
I didn't get invited. She got invited. That's huge. It's, it's I, it's, yeah, it's unbelievable for me still. It's, it's wow. believable. Wow. <laughs> and do you have an autographed copy of your yes, book? Yes, I do. Wow. I'm so, oh, I'm, I'm this. I cherish this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so I want, I want two pictures, one with Sanjana and one without, okay? Yeah, oh, oh yes, and an award. Oh my god, I forgot what I'm doing, I'm so excited. So we have the Transformational Leader Award. Congratulations. Wow. Thank you. Wow. Wow. Why don't you hold, oh, I'll hold the award. You hold your book. Okay. And you cuddle right in. Okay, and now you go away just a few feet. Okay. Thank wow. You. Thank you. So you take this. Send Jenna's book once the last time. Unbelievable. I have a library of these, all autographed. I have so many of them. I, everyone is special to me. Oh my God, I'm so happy. Moira!